Oh, welcome back to the great show on YouTube. I'm of course Ferrari King. We're gonna try some of those vampires. See if we can get this taken care of. I doubt we will be able to. In case you're wondering what I've been doing, he has a nice voice. I like this guy's voice. But what I've been doing is I've been going around. I've spoken to a couple of people and healed a lot of sick people. That's why I have so much XP. And so far, I haven't eaten anybody. I don't want to. And also, Swansea kind of warned me not to do it, you know. He's like, try not to eat so many people in this hospital. I need to get, like, a protection thing, you know, one of those blood shields. I know what I should do. It's... Oh, come on, Duke Gay. But which one is... Is you using, though? Oh, you don't know what you're doing, so I can, you could either be doing this one or this crap. So the whole time you had that one, I don't know, what the hell are you doing, actually? I don't get it, what the hell are you doing? Seriously, you're not going to let me... Ah, uh, you don't allow it. Oh, Man, I mean, let's see how many hits does this dumbass get before he runs out of his uh, joints. One, two, three, four, five. Seriously, five? Who? What type of puss gets tired after five, hitting someone five times? Come on, come on. Come on, hit him already, one time. Come on, get, get magic power. Eat. He's food. He's food. He's food. I'll play on his behalf. Come on, burn him. You heard him. You heard him. Come on. You heard him. No, that's why he does his fire. He does his fire on it. No! No! No, you idiot! No, you screwed up. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. Eat him! I thought, I thought you did something wrong, dude. I actually thought you were stupid. Oh, man, you did this easy, too. The wounds on this corpse are deep. The result the of rabid rage. If this is Sean's doing, he's become a murderous beast. How the hell is that like that though? Last time they beat my ass. And he didn't level up at all. See, now you got a good weapon. Blinker Skull level 16. I almost want to take that bastard out. Well, he's not here though, he's over there, but. Damn. Oh, Blinker Skull, that means Skull, Skull, or whatever the hell. That means he's gonna come back to me. Is there any hints or anything that we want? See, I was trying to the clouds. I had to force this dumbass to use the right weapon. That was okay, that's, that's offhand. Come on, Dookie. Don't we have something that gives us? There's one. We had a needle, though. Blood absorption. That I like. So, bet you can't get him to use a, a weapon or a gun. Oh, that's fine. I like. 
we gotta get you up here which from where I saw from watching other people play is not the easiest thing to do alright there's a werewolf oh excuse me not a werewolf a, a beast I don't trust your ability to take him down. Believe I'm doing this. Just deal with it. Just be a man. I have this thirst for blood. Well, then punch it. This is despicable. Well, it could be worse, Dookie Ho. It could be me. Damn it, damn it. See, it's showing you if you go this way, but you can't go that way. Watch. It's always locked. Every damn way you want to go is locked. Oh, I still got one more of his me. I can't believe I'm doing this. Well, I can. You're a vampire. Shoot, that's how this thing killed me in two hits. Well, it's too late now. Come on, kill a beast, tell us, kill magic, kill him. Come on, let me see him, because if he hit you just once, eat, 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 food, kiss food, kiss food. He's a better weapon now. It's like he really don't want to fight. He just wants to like give him BJ's and stuff. Okay, be on a lot. Oh, you could have let me see what that newspaper article was. alcohol he could keep this district afloat for quite some time see this is what I'm getting now it's showing me what that investigation but when I'm looking for it it's nice to know how to find a stupid crap yeah, let's find this Tom Dookie Ho you're not Tom you're not Tom you're definitely not Tom. You're not Tom. You're not Tom. You're not Tom. You're the guy we're looking for and I want to eat you. You're not Tom. Damn, you're Tom. Can you please at least? I don't know how to find the bastard. It's Tom again. That's not Tom. Damn it. See, it doesn't give you anything where you can find the side missions. Oh, yeah, I don't need to go back in there. You're a vampire, you're already dead. See, that's what the problem was, that dumbass wasn't using the right weapon, so he's getting himself killed. Over there. No! Come on, kill him! Quick! Eat tits food! Tits food! If you watch that movie Black Knight, the guy that like, tits food about to get Martin Lawrence. Wait, wait, Martin Lawrence's character goes back in time, but when he's trying to give the guy, he gives the guy money and the guy's happy that he's talking and being friendly, so he gives him food. But he's feeding him a rat. 
He's like, what's that? Ron Larson's character, what's that? And that guy's like, test food. Of course it's funnier when you watch the movie. I'm definitely not funny or interesting. I killed you guys. Y'all left. Kill him. I think we've been here already. It's more fun when your character can fight. Too bad I have no idea how to get him to go where I want him to go, but... If I can find that bar, it would be nice. Give him that Akihau. Well, that's not where we want to go. Don't want to do that. Yeah, tons of bullets, but he can't use his gun, so... Maybe you guys can't... Oh, there's somebody to talk to. I cannot enter. Of course you can't enter! Since when can you ever freaking enter? Maybe we can... There's a way out some other way. And if you were like a real man, you could just climb up here, climb up there, and then... Too bad you're not a real man. You could just easily get up, easily get over there. Still a good game, it's just, you know, me suck. Where's this lead? Sometimes you can just go around. Locked. Of course. What you been doing though? You've been getting your ass whooped. There's nowhere to go. Better go home, sir. I said go back home. Watch yourselves. This way. Watch your gun. Come on, hands free. Yeah, beat his ass. Beat that. Beat his ass. His ass. Not yours. I will beat your ass. Kiss food. Kiss food. How did that guy die? Oh. I thought maybe you had a special ability I didn't know about. Come on, hurry up, hurry up. Finally. Christ, he's dead. And so are you. What the hell? Are you dead? Aw, oh, you're a puss. Damn, he's a pussy's pussy. Damn, this guy dies too easy. Forget about how quick and easy he dies. I have to remember, he dies easy. A little bit of garlic and he's dead. There's a movie with James Wood, a vampire movie, and tell me if you use vampire uh, garlic, they'll just bend you over backwards and suck your blood out that way. Man, this guy sucks at funny. Of course, I could just be a noob. So now we want to find that Sean dude. I'd like to find the guy, but it's not easy. I had a boring long meeting once, something, but I didn't pick it up or anything. It might have been football tickets. I'm not into football. Yeah, I know. I could have given it to someone else, but why? Well, at least you're back home. You still get points for killing that one dumbass. No. How am I supposed to get over there, though? And everyone comes back. Shh. I don't think we were here. Shh. No one behind you. No one behind you. 
Ah, oh, shoot. You don't give him a chance to kill you. Come on, let me see. At least your buttholes are, your butthole friends aren't helping. Glad your butthole friends aren't helping you. Now you let me see that. I know that some of our companions consider that the best advantage we have in our fight against leeches is that they can't go out during the day. That's when we can hunt them down when they hide tireless from their sleep. This is a rookie mistake. First, because vampires are clever and they have countless ruses and tricks to avoid being spotted in their den. Second, because they deploy manly daily traps to kill any intruders in what they consider their most precious sanctuary. It would cost us too many men and too much time to explore the Reddit vampires in their hideouts. The best tactic is to follow and destroy them when they really are vulnerable. When they hunt at night, it's much easier to attack them then, for they can easily be spotted. That's why the guard of Purin must evolve and deploy new tactics to hunt leeches. Small and mobile patrols, tactics based on technological advantages, modern communications. We can learn many things from the war in France, new strategy, new equipment, and new weaponry. Grenades, white phosphorus, UV light, bulletproof vests, and flame. Thrower. It is time for the guard to embrace the 20th century. Wow. If you really think about it, they're not really the bad guys. I mean, I know it sounds like... Shoot. Could have... And just think if he had just appeared right... Over there. One of them vermin. Oh, yeah. You don't call me vermin. You're vermin. You carry my food in your veins. So nobody called me vermin. What the hell? Didn't we just kill you? I guess they do reappear. Oh, you idiot! Stay on his butthole. I know you love him, but he doesn't like you. Oh, this is another one. He's 22. The other one was 21. Oh, I mean, stop missing, you idiot. Damn, these things are fast. Move, 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 move. Damn, you idiot. Come on, hit now. R2 for you, you idiot. R. R. It is the same one. Yeah, it was harder that time. I wish I knew how to get over there, you know? No, I don't think that's the same one. I don't think this is it. Oh, it's not going to get you what you want. Where are we at, anyways? It's not where we, Oh, I know what we could do. It's a hard way to do it. It might not work. It won't work. How the hell do you get over there, though? I should know how to get over there. It's locked, all right. I know, it always is. Oh, yeah. I helped you the other day. I talked to her last time. I helped you today. The one with Neuroglia, I helped. I ought to eat her just to eat her, but... Oh, there's what we're looking for. Okay. I think I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind too because this thing's slow. Hurry up, load. Welcome back, Doctor. What can I do for you? You ain't ready. You lied to me, Tom. 
Your warehouse wasn't empty. It was inhabited with armed vigilantes. I'm sorry, Dr. Reed, but I thought those Prewan guards would be willing to let someone like you pass without trouble. That was devious of you, Tom. Next time you can bloody well go yourself. I apologize, Doctor, but it, it's just that I prefer to avoid the law, its enforcers, and all manner of thugs in uniform. Here is your booze. I hope it will appease your customers. Just try not to kill anyone with this poison of yours. <laughs> Believe me, Doctor, most of my customers are less agreeable when sober. Do you need any help? I'm all right, Dr. Reed. Goodbye, Mr. Watts. Sorry she were out to talk last time, but of course there's no way to listen to their conversations. So I have no idea what they were talking about. If you wonder what they were talking about. I hope I live long enough to see them wear boots. I should have offered a drink to the boy. Get to a point where you just want to eat everybody. Damn, what did you do that for? I did. All right, I gotta turn that down so you can let me. See. Oh, you're supposed to get over there. this way and then I can do it by it. I wish I knew how the hell to get to where I need to go to. Is there anything up here? Can you let me see? Oh, he's dead. Stop swinging. He's dead. I promise you're safe. You're safe, baby. See, that's the bridge to get you over here. It doesn't make any damn sense that you can't get over there. Plus, if this damn gate wasn't locked. I cannot enter. Damn it, how are you supposed to do this?
try this way. What? Serious? Why is ours serious? Someone else would go out there in there. Alright, let's not mess with them. Shoot. Can we kind of see at least what level they are and stuff? Gee whiz. do the fighting and we do our duty and find our buddy damn those bastards are everywhere I know most people get through this a lot faster than me but I don't because I try to enjoy the game and take my sweet ass time there's just no one watches, why should I be fast anyway? Safer places to be than here. Yeah, like your ass. Last huh? morning, sir. Over there! There's one ah! Eat pistol, pistol, pistol. Ah! Must be dead. Come on, Duke. Man, they scream. Damn, my little bitches. Damn, October 27th. Some of our scouts recently spotted, scout spotted the presence of certain Echabah Thorgmorton near the East Dock Inns. You probably see him patrolling the place at night, claiming that he's a specialist in vampire extermination. Man's a fraud, or even a real con man. Well, he does not charge anybody for the work, but he clearly has no clue what he's talking about. If you ever push you for some joint hunt or collaboration, refuse and let him go. In a leech fight, the man is nothing more than bait. <laughs> Dumbass. Oh, we beast. Glad I went this way. Man. I hate to just peer down there because it's all I know will get screwed again. It's hard to really say where you have to go. Damn. Nice. Night shelters vicinity. That's not what I wanted you to do. Can you please? Okay, that's where I'm Yeah, watch that bust out. Eat the hell out of you. Oh man, come on with the loading. Perhaps Sean knows something about him. Uh, I have no idea what you're saying, lady. That this thing is too busy to loading. It takes like 30 minutes. Good evening, miss. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. May I have your attention for a minute? Good evening, sir. My name is Giselle Paxton. But I don't have time for men like you. Have we met before? No. But I just need to look at your fancy clothes to know that you must be desperate to visit the docks at night. That's quite judgmental of you. Sir, I've led enough strikes when I had a job to identify you as an enemy of the working class. <sighs> Typical scum. Do you need medical help, Miss Paxton? No, thank you. I'm looking for Sean Hampton. Can you help me? What is it you want? Does he owe you money? Has he displeased your royal highness? I'm Aww. no snitch, Mr. Fancy Pants. No, but you're gonna become dinner. Let me see something real quick. What? That's not what I wanna see. Damn. Thousand. Yeah, your dinner. Eventually. May I ask what you do for a living? I'm killing myself scraping for a living. And you? 
Have you ever had to struggle in your entire life? Damn, what a bitch. As I told you, I'm a doctor. You have to work a lot to earn that title. Oh, a doctor. Hmm, born with money in a nice house, were we? Is Daddy a banker or a doctor himself? I actually, I kind of understand how, how, what, where she's coming from because you know you listen to these idiot celebrities and all these billionaires and billionaires talking down to the rest of us that have no money and they talk about white privilege or oh, your privilege. You're like, shut the hell up, you're rich. I'm living in poverty, so shut the hell. Like, right, what was that one last time? What was her name just a couple of days ago? I can't think of her name right now. Oh, it doesn't matter. They're insignificant. Why such hatred? Are you judging me by my clothes and my job? Of course I am. Fuck, you're so blind. You don't even see your privilege. Lazy people like you disgust me. This thing doesn't work very well, you can tell. What can you tell me about this vicinity? Tell you what. Just spend a few weeks here, and then ask me that question again. If you're still alive, I mean. He's dead. If you have something to say, Say it. I'm getting tired of all this. Oh. You want information instead? Well, here's some for you. Giselle Paxton does not like you at all, Doctor. You don't know me, Miss Paxton, and yet you see me as an enemy. Oh, your manners, your clothes, your words tell me everything about you, sir. I know your kind, and you don't belong here. You're right. I have never suffered from poverty. But that doesn't mean I don't fight it and its consequences. I really doubt you ever had to fight for anything in your life, Dr. Reed. <laughs> Let me go ahead and talk to somebody real quick. I want to just... You speak of strikes yeah, yeah. and class enemy. Am I right to assume you're involved in trade union activism? You bet I am. Well, I was. Nowadays, I'm just another worker blacklisted by the big companies. Isn't the whole point of trade unions to help workers in need? Why don't they support you? A few nights back, I lost the money my companions had asked me to hide. With me and my sister being penniless, they thought I stole it. What really happened? I drank too much that night. Strange men saw me count the money in that bar. Some sort of militia in uniform. I'm sure they robbed me. Yeah, I'm not surprised. You lost your job because of your beliefs. Those bastards really hate the now. worker who refuses slave wages and unsafe conditions, especially when it's a woman. You're tired of this headphone going out. Can't hear you yet, but I don't know how to find these stupid side missions. Well, I'll leave you for now. Goodbye, Miss Paxton. Is it your sister supposed to be around here somewhere? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, baby. Good evening, Miss. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. Can I help you? A fancy doctor lurking at night by the docks. <laughs> Not fishy at all. And what about <laughs> you? Working outside at night in this dangerous part of town. You want to know my secret? I'm trying to earn money. And I'm Lottie Paxton, by the way. I'm looking for Sean Hampton. Can you help me? Mr. Hampton must be in his office at the night asylum he manages, I suppose. Why do you want to see him? He was a patient of mine at the Pembroke Hospital. But he left abruptly. I see. Well, Mr. Hampton is a discreet and dedicated man. I'm sure you'll find him soon enough. Yeah. Do you need my medical attention, Miss Paxton? I'm fine, Dr. Reed. Keep your medicine for those who need it. I wonder why she's nice and her sister's a, you know, biatch. Is it not dangerous to work here at night? As long as I have good legs, I can run away from trouble. The sad saint now provides me and my sister a bed and a roof. I don't want to lose that. Are you homeless, Miss Paxton? Mr. Hampton's night asylum is our new home now. It's a safe place for me and my sister. 
What can you tell me about the Sad Saint? It's just the nickname of Sean Hampton, the Sad Saint of the East End. He gave me shelter, and he's not always sad. <laughs> what can you tell me about this place? How are things here? It may be okay for a strong girl like me, but a dandy doctor from the city like yourself? You better watch your back, Mr. Reed. You really think I should go back to a safer place, miss? No. I think you had better stay and help as many people as you can. Just avoid the wet boot boys. Those bastards are worse than the epidemic. Which local dangers must I avoid? Well, the gangs, the thieves, the drunks, the jobless. A man with your fancy clothes will attract a lot of attention. Well, I am not someone so easily intimidated. Glad to hear that. And if you get into trouble, you can always seek help at Sean Hampton's shelter. No one would dare to be violent there. Goodbye, Miss Paxton. Yeah. Come now, no, no. Lottie. There is still much work to do. Uh, what happened? Did it move them somewhere else? On the stairs. Oh, we have stairs in his office. Hopefully, we get to eat them now. Damn. You say he's in here. So much bullets. You know he's in here, just doesn't tell you, give you any hints or anything. Can't be everywhere. Maybe we have to climb down. Wouldn't that be his office though? Please, damn it, Dookie. Now we gotta hope he finds him. A wide, a long face, Doctor. Damn. Is it all that worries you, Sean? My long face? Really? This is a blessing for me to become a skull. Immortality gives me more time and energy, if truth be known, to run a shelter. <laughs> what more could I want? Since you left Pembroke, the amount of blood that has been shed, it's hard to believe you, Sean. Ask what you will. As the Lord is my shepherd, I will not speak a lie to you. Why did you kill Miss Jones at the Pembroke Hospital? Killed old Harriet? You must be mad, Doctor. Why would I do such a thing? So you claim Miss Jones' death was not by your hand, nor the other incidents at Pembroke? Though Harriet was an angry, spiteful woman, she was one of God's creatures. I have nothing but love for all he has made. But you were close to her? Of course. But she was lost, separated from the fold. She did not see the hand of the divine in my blessed condition. Okay. What are we supposed to do now? People have been murdered. Oh. I've seen the blood. I don't believe you can be trusted. Have a little faith, Doctor. Oops. If you will follow, 
I will guide you to the light. How do you plan to do that? Take this key of the old sewers. The entrance is by the riverbank, south from here. There you'll find all the proof you need. Very well. You have definitely intrigued me. I hope you're right, Sean. I'll be here when you return. If you still think I'm a threat then, well, I surrender myself to your judgment. Well, all I can say is that stews, what you guys do, let's see if there's anything else to eat. We'll eat you in a moment. Can eat you now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share. Ah, oh, come on, dude. It doesn't matter. Now you are screwed at it, but. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Don't forget to watch my other videos. Don't forget to check the description for a link to my website where I sell ebooks for 99 cents. Thanks for watching.